The accident involving the aircraft operated by Silverstone Air happened at 9.02 local time after it skid off the runway at Wilson Airport during the takeoff to Mombasa on its way to Lamu. The Fokker 50 aircraft registration number 51IZO is said to have been self serviceable before its takeoff. However, according to the Silverstone management, investigations into the matter regarding to the crash is still ongoing and is being conducted by the Aircraft Accident Investigation Directorate to establish the cause of the crash. Um, I am currently not in a position to give any details on the preliminary investigations. And I would like you to know that aircraft, Silverstone aircrafts and pilots are maintained and trained in accordance with the requirements of the Kenya Civil Aviation Authorities. No fatalities have been reported, but nine passengers were seriously injured and have been taken to hospital. Operations at the Silverstone Air will continue as usual, with the management assuring Kenyans of their speedy investigation. Silverstone Air Services is working with all the relevant agencies as required to establish the cause of the incident and will keep you updated on any information as we get it. This will be the first incident of a failure of an aircraft witness since the start of its flight operations by the Silverstone Air. This year, 157 perished on board in Ethiopian plane crash few minutes after taking off due to a technical hitch that has since then been confirmed by the Boeing company. Milo Kisenya for Ebro TV.